Welcome back to another edition of Inside Western Wrestling. Hey, we appreciate hearing from all the fans and alumni uh, replying back to emails to Coach Pfeiffer from our first edition. Uh, we've heard from people from uh, Jerry, Pennsylvania, Medford, Wisconsin, Truth or Consequences, New Mexico, and all over the country. So it's always good to hear from you guys. Uh, answering a few questions uh, as far as from alum, uh, Dodge City, Kansas, uh, Lars Luters. I have some really good questions there. I really want to know about the uh, new recruits coming in. Uh, we have 17 new uh, recruits, a, a great core class. Uh, they're, they're working hard, looking great. Uh, we're really expecting a big impact on all 17 of those guys. As we start getting closer, uh, maybe we'll start throwing some names out there. Uh, we have some uh, alums like uh, Troy Brown from uh, West Point, Utah, some of the great uh, uh, wrestlers and, uh, uh, to us, and also uh, some other alums I know have, uh, have been doing a good job uh, keeping them in touch with uh, Mountaineer Wrestling. So, uh, just wanted to thank for everybody again. Uh, a few things that are coming up. Uh, we have our huge event. It's the uh, preseason victory party and the uh, Mountaineer Wrestling uh, Reverse Raffle. And also, uh, that for that event, that, that's going to be Saturday, October 12th. We'll be uh, hosting the 1963 and 1964 National Championship teams. Uh, we got a lot of the members coming in. It's their 50th year reunion. We're lo really looking forward to those guys coming back home and reminiscing with their team members and the rest of the Mountaineer Wrestling family. Also, the night before the uh, our, our banquet uh, is the Mountaineer Sports Hall of Fame uh, banquet, which will be Friday, October 11th. We have two awesome wrestlers that are going into the hall, the, the class of 2013. National champion Dave Bondi and three-time All-American Ernie Jimenez, two very well-deserving guys that are going into the Hall of Fame. Uh, really looking forward to those guys coming back home as well. So we hope to hear back from more of you guys. Our condolences go out to all the uh, Colorado victims and uh, families out there that are dealing with the Colorado flooding. We hope uh, uh, you guys are recovering. And if there's anything that we can do for you guys, please let us know. Go Mountaineers.